my name is Arijit. Uh, I work for Strigen Technologies as an architect, and right now I'm uh, I'm a filler. So, okay. So before I proceed with my uh, my talk, how many of you know about QZ.com? Hands. Quartz, QZ, QZ.com. Okay, it's loading. And just a quick uh, thing about this particular website. Uh, within its three months of launch, its page hits actually exceeded that of Economic Times, and that was a very big thing. I think it was in 12, uh, 2012 when it happened. And uh, why was it? Because of its content. Definitely yes. It has got very good content, but apart from that, it had a very unique kind of navigation system. Uh, I need the site to load to go further. Okay. Okay. Um, so this particular site, do not use any pagers. Uh, whenever you scroll down, uh, still loading. It's taking up my time. Okay, until it loads, uh, it's based on jQuery, so uh, JavaScript, so it will take time to uh, load first. Uh, so whenever you scroll down, the URL changes, and instead of uh, Going on the next page, uh, next article loads, the URL changes and it is taken as a hit by Google. So, uh, okay. okay. I'm really sorry, it's, uh, it's not working right now. It's still loading. So, actually, uh, my flash talk is about an open source project that we created. Uh, a fine day, a few days back, my boss called me and uh, showed me this particular site. He said, uh, have you seen QZ.com? Like a uh, lot many of us, I had no idea. So he said, uh, see this, QZ.com, it has got so many hits, blah, blah, blah. I was like, yes, boss. He said, uh, it's a fantastic thing. Yeah, that's right. I want this kind of a blog on my region site. Very good. Build it. And we were given two weeks to build this particular website uh, in this format where the URL changes whenever you scroll and it's kind of an unlimited scrolling. Uh, and me and my team have actually pulled it off uh, in the last few days and that's what I wanted to showcase here. Um, we have tried to make it open source, uh, kind of a front end framework where you can put in your uh, URL for your RSS feed. And uh, it will show you all your all your feed in this particular format. Uh, it's loading even faster than quartz. Good news for us. Okay, uh, this particular thing is working, uh, though it's still not loaded. This is basically built in Angular JS, and uh, whenever you scroll, uh, it will change the URL and will take as a hit in Google. Uh, you have got a navigation in the sidebar, otherwise, uh, how many articles you have, even it's 100, 150, 200, without and taking any performance hit, it will go on loading all your uh, pages uh, with changing the URL. Um, it works both ways. You scroll down or you scroll up. This will change and will take as a page hit. So it's just a different kind of navigation. It's totally a front end thingy. It doesn't depend how you put in the content. You're using WordPress, Drupal, or any other customized framework.
to pull in the content. We just need the API or probably the RSS feeds to feed in the data. Um, we actually yesterday only, uh, just before the flash talks, we just tried to create a demo, uh, put it up on GitHub, uh, make it open source. Um, here's uh, the page. There's very less documentation. Uh, we have worked on the inline documentation, but other documentation still lacks. Uh, name of the project is Saris, and uh, we like some uh, contribution uh, towards it. It has got a lot of bugs and uh, uh, some uh, improvement tasks that uh, we need to pin down. So uh, we'd like you to just go through it once and see if uh, you can help us in any way. Uh, I think that that was it. Quartz is still loading, so probably you can use it on your own laptops and see how it works. I'm sorry. Thanks.